the youngest billionaires in the world. Can you imagine having billions of dollars in your account and just in your 20s? Well, this is what we all desire, right? As some of us fantasize about the life of billionaires, some young fellows are actually living it. The majority of the people who become billionaires are above 30 or 40 years of age. But today in this video, we'll find out the youngest billionaires in the world. Hey everybody, welcome back to Modern Luxury. Today, we are going to go over the youngest billionaires in the world. But before we dive into the list of billionaires, take a guess at the net worth of the wealthiest young billionaire and see how close you are by the end of this video. Let's start with our list. Number 7. Alexander Wang Alexander Wang is one of the most recent, youngest self-made billionaires. Wang's Scale AI is one of the biggest high-tech companies in the United States. His innovative work in the field of artificial intelligence is exceptional and has gained humongous hype during the Russian and Ukrainian war. But how? It's because his company is charged with the duty to analyze and calculate the damage caused due to the war. Wang's company gained immense popularity after several deals with the U.S. Armed Forces, adding more credibility to his company, Scale AI. The net worth of his company skyrocketed to $7.2 billion in 2022, and the young billionaire owns about 15% of the company. Surprisingly, Wang is also one of those school dropouts who became billionaires in the future. He started his company when he was only 19 and left his school. The young intelligent boy is only 25 and has entered the list of billionaires with a surprise for sure. It might take some time for him to go out in public more frequently in flashy cars, but he will surely come out as an inspiration for many around the globe. Number 6. Alexandra Anderson At the age of 24, Alexandra Anderson has a fortune valued at $1.4 billion. Alexandra became a billionaire before she even turned 20. Ever imagine what it would be like to be a teenage billionaire? Well, Alexandra would surely know. Her father, Johan H. Anderson, is a Norwegian entrepreneur, and the Anderson family is one of the most well-known cigarette manufacturers in Europe from 1849 to 2005. The family has tremendous real estate assets. An investment company by the name of Ferd is owned by the family. Alexandra Anderson is the inheritor of Ferd, and it's one of Norway's largest private companies. Both sisters own 42.2% of the company. Alexandra appeared on the list of billionaires back in 2016 when she was only 19 years old. Currently, the young, hardworking woman is competing as a professional equestrian at an international level, and she is sponsored by brands with a good reputation. The other billionaire sister, Katrina, is also said to handle the fortune well enough and give her name to the family business. Number 5. Austin Russell The next time somebody tells you that school dropouts don't make a living, show them Austin Russell, as he is also a school dropout like Wang, who became a billionaire before the age of 30. He left the school after one of his projects got attention while he was studying at Stanford University. Austin Russell is now the founder and CEO of Luminar, the company that has played a pivotal role in the development of autonomous cars. Russell was born and raised in Newport Beach, California. As a highly intelligent child, he was able to memorize the periodic table by the age of two. Surprising, isn't it? He founded Luminar at the age of 17. The total net worth of his company is now $2.67 billion, and the company is partnered with Volvo and Toyota. The evolution of self-driving cars is due to the efforts of Russell. The young billionaire is striving to expand his business and reach higher skies of success. His philanthropic efforts are non-negotiable, as he donated $4 million to Team C's in January 2022, and $70 million to the Central Florida Foundation. Currently, the 26-year-old school dropout has a net worth of $1.6 billion. Number 4. Andy Fang If you were living in the United States during the COVID-19 lockdown, you are more likely to know Andy Fang, as he was one of the founders of DoorDash, an online food delivery company based in San Francisco, California. The company went public in 2020 and is currently the largest food delivery company in the United States, with a 56% market share. DoorDash has a net worth of about $4.67 billion, and Andy has 4% of the company to his name. 
Apart from the online food delivery company, Andy is working on several other projects that get him a decent fortune. Other than that, he invests an immense amount of money in the stock market too. Andy is known for raising his fortune by a billion dollars in a few months. Like all young entrepreneurs, he's more interested in reinvesting the money in his business rather than going for a luxurious lifestyle. The young entrepreneur has a $2.24 billion fortune at the age of 30. Number 3. John Collison Sliding into the top three youngest billionaires in the world, we have John Collison. He is the co-founder and president of Stripe, a financial service company. John has been named the youngest self-made billionaire in 2016. He founded Stripe at the age of 18, and the plans were backed up by his brother Patrick, who's another billionaire in the family. The company has a highly credible system, making it a pillar of several financial services worldwide. After witnessing the remarkable success of the company, John received backing from some of the most famous people in the world, such as Elon Musk and Peter Thiel. Soon, Capital G invested in his company, and John made the first billion at the age of 25. The current net worth of Stripe is more than $95 billion, and the young billionaire has a net worth of $11.4 billion. With all this money to his name, John loves flying planes, as he can surely afford private jets. Number 2. Stanley Tang The Hong Kong billionaire Stanley Tang is the co-founder of DoorDash, the online food delivery company which was started by Andy Fang, Tony Hsu, and Evan Moore. Tang started climbing the ladder of success at the age of 14 when he wrote an Amazon best-selling ebook. Andy Fang was his classmate at Stanford University, and from there, both of them started a highly successful company. The DoorDash app allowed people to order food with a few clicks during the pandemic, and three out of five orders were done by Tang's co-founded company. However, it was just one of the few steps that Tang took to enlist himself into the list of billionaires. The young brilliant mind also loves playing poker, as he has stunned the world with his skills in the game. Tang's net worth grew from $2.2 billion to an unbelievable $18.8 .8 billion in a very short time. And in the number one spot, Samuel Bankman Freed. Samuel Bankman Freed, or commonly known as SBF, is an American billionaire and investor. He is the founder and CEO of a cryptocurrency exchange known as FTX. Crypto investors around the world are well aware of SBF's efforts to uplift the industry. In the 2022 list of Forbes billionaires, he ranked at number 60. Bankman Freed was born on the campus of Stanford University, as both of his parents were professors at Stanford Law School. He spent much of his time at the campus and showed interest in basketball and politics. He graduated with a degree in physics back in 2014. Before starting his own business, he worked at a number of trading firms. Unlike other billionaires, Bankman Freed doesn't like living a luxurious life with expensive clothes, having private jets, or having supercars. In fact, he likes living a simple life in his office, where he often sleeps on his beanbag. Bankman Freed is known for spending much of his time in the office and barely goes out. However, he is one of the biggest donors in the U.S. He gives millions of dollars to charity with the belief in social well-being. As being interested in politics, SBF supports the Democratic leader Joe Biden and even gave $5 million to his campaign in 2020. With a net worth of about $24 billion, Samuel Bankman Freed tops our list of the youngest billionaires in the world. I hope you found these exciting journeys of young billionaires interesting. Make sure you subscribe and turn on the notifications so you don't miss more videos of modern luxury because you're one step closer to everything luxury. And don't forget to check out this playlist of my 10 videos of luxury content and I'll see you in the next video as more luxurious content is coming your way. Thanks for watching. Take care.